What's up guys, Legionnaire here to teach you how easy it is to download custom songs, avatars, and Saber into Beat Saber with just one click. Yes, you heard it right. All you need is to have Mod Assistant downloaded and installed onto your computer. If you haven't already installed Mod Assistant, I will have a tutorial link in the description. Alright, let's get into this. First, you want to open Mod Assistant app. From there, you want to make sure you have the correct mods selected and installed. Go to Mods section and make sure you have custom avatars, custom sabers, camera plus, as well as Beat Saber Downloader check. Go to the Options tab and make sure that you enabled everything including the one-click install feature. Then click the Install or Update button. Now time to install like crazy. Go to bsaber.com and go to the song section. Filter out to any song from genre to difficulty levels. You can do a quick listen preview of the songs by clicking on the music note icon to play on your desktop or laptop or click the play button to see an in-game preview. Once you've selected the song, click the cloud icon to initiate the one-click install. Then a pop-up will ask if you want to open Mod Assistant. Click yes and another pop-up indicating that the song was downloaded will appear on the bottom right screen. Moving on to Avatars, hover over the Plugins tab and click on Avatars. Despite what you see right now, there are other avatars you can choose from. Once you find an avatar, you want to just click install and you will get the same pop-ups as before. Same thing with sabers, if we go over there, select the sabers you want and do the same process. Rinse and repeat and before you know it, you will have a library of custom mods to play with. If for whatever reason the one click install feature is not working, then you can simply download it manually by clicking on the download sections. Open the files and extract the content to their respective folders. I'm using BandyZip to open the file folders for the songs. I will put a link down below, but you can use whatever file extracting software you have or prefer to use. Songs go into the custom levels folder that's located in the Beat Saber data folder. As you can already tell, I have two file folders open, one being for the downloads and the other being the path to my Beat Saber folder. You can see that it appeared in that folder. With avatars and sabers, it's just a normal file that you can click, grab, and drop into their folders. Now to see if all of this work, I open Beat Saber, go to solo, and I filter out to my newest songs that I added, and you can see both songs I downloaded using both methods are there. Going back and into the mods tab and then into sabers, you can see the sabers I have recently downloaded. Into the avatars tab, my avatar selection appears on the right side and you can see the avatars I have downloaded. In order to view your avatars in game for a third person recording session, just right mouse click on your Beat Saber monitor screen. I had to lift my oculus slightly up my face to see what I was doing. A menu will pop up and you will click third person and your screen will change to view it from that perspective. In the game, you can turn around and see the box camera and by pointing at it, pressing and holding the trigger, you can grab it and move it around to your liking. Note that it will be first person when using the oculus, but your recordings will be in third person. If you want to go back to first person recordings, just right click on the monitor screen and it will say first person and click on it. And that's it! You are now a master at making your experience within Beat Saber much better. I tried my best to keep everything short and to the point without overlooking anything. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe for more future content. As always, if you have questions or problems, leave a comment down below and I will try my best to help out as I have done so in my previous videos. 
but I highly suggest joining the Beat Saber modding community discord for all current news, updates, and troubleshooting for Beat Saber mods. It has helped me a lot and others and is my number one source for getting the answers to problems that I don't even know. With that being said, my name is Legionnaire and I bid you all a good gaming day. Legion out.